men's basketball coach John Dunn off of the St. Peter's 68-53 setback to Elon. Coach, opening statement. Yeah, just um, thought we had great energy uh, to start the game on the defensive end. We left a lot of points off the board, uh, missing a lot of makeable shots in the first half, and the first half is tied. Um, and they had a lot more energy uh, in the second half, which is disappointing since they had a tough travel day yesterday and, and it was a home game um, for us. So we have to look in the mirror and figure out why we can't have better energy in the second half. A lot of times you don't have good energy when you're not scoring the ball. Um, and when you go 14 from 41 from two, um, it, it's going to be hard. So we got to continue to work, continue to get better as individuals, continue to get better as a team. Um, our energy, effort, attitude, everything needs to get better. Um, we have a day off tomorrow, uh, try to improve the next few days and, and try to get a win uh, Friday at St. Francis, New York. Um, tied at the half and then they jumped out to a quick lead and then you guys were able to battle back. Namdi got hot there uh, for a few minutes. Was there a point in the latter part of the second half where you felt that, that it started to slip away? Was there anything in particular? Inspired. Yeah, it wasn't good when they hit the three in transition. Um, and I think it stayed at seven for a little while. Um, maybe it was 52 45, not exactly sure. But, um, you know, we, we just, uh, our inability to score in the paint um, really, really hurt us. And uh, you, know, you got to put the ball in the basket if you want to win the game. Um, and if you're not putting it in the basket, you got to be uh, have a more of a grind mentality defensively. And we didn't have either. Talk about the bench contributions today, specifically Kayvon Baker and uh, Mamadou coming off the bench, giving the spark. Yeah, Kavon was, uh, um, you know, a big, a big positive for us in the day that there wasn't a lot of positives. Um, you know, we know he's a talented guy. Um, you know, trying to fit in, trying to play, you know, do things the right way. Um, I think he's maintained a good attitude um, through the course of, of the season so far, and it showed today. And, Thought he was mentally really ready to play the game, and um, you know he he, he was uh, he did a good job for us, and hopefully we can build upon that for him. And and um, and, and, and Mamadou uh, um, is also a guy that can bring us nice energy off the bench. I think he had a uh, you know obviously got some offensive rebounds um, for us. Had three in, in 13 minutes. Um, and, uh, and that was positive. He got to do a little bit job, better job finishing when he's in there. But um, I liked his energy, and um, you know these guys can earn more minutes if they keep playing with energy. Uh, just one free throw today. Um, was that a, a product of the game plan shooting more from the outside, or was it just, just like the way the way the contest progressed? No. So what teams are doing is they're really crowding us in the paint and um, double, and then these guys haven't double teamed the whole year, and now they would double team it. Quadir, um, you know, to take him out of the game, and you know, you gotta, you, you gotta make teams pay for doing that by making threes or, you know, driving off the inside-out uh, pass um, and getting a quality shot either at the rim or, or getting fouled. And again, like they weren't, they, they're, they're, they're a program that doesn't foul, um, but so you gotta do better than 14 for 41 for two. All right, thanks, coach. Thanks, thanks coach.